Hey everybody, Anne here, and just look at this fire. I just love it. This is the eve of the last day um, that I'm going to be here at this camp spot, and it's a really, really cool spot. It's kind of like out on a little point that juts out into the lake. I've got the whole area on myself. I would love to have the son and the kids and his wife here at some point to kind of share this with me, or maybe even go to one of the more remote areas and just kind of chill out and and have a good time. It's been a really good camping trip this time. I caught a lot of fish. I fed myself fish protein for two nights in a row. Fed Betty as well. And uh, yeah, this is the last campfire because after this I'm going to be out of wood. But uh, I'll be back and next time, I don't know, my son uh, has a bunch of wood so hopefully I'll be able to get some wood and have a fire every single night. So yeah, pretty cool. Well, this is my last night camping until I have to go back to the grind of work. It's been really nice. No fire tonight. I have no wood. I've already broken down the, the canopy and everything. and I've got my girl sitting here right next to me. Just calm as can be because nobody's driving by in their golf carts. <laughs> but uh, I love this lake. Next time I'm going to camp in a different spot, I'm going to ask him if I can. It's kind of like way, 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 way off that way in the distance, away from everybody. Nobody ever camps there, so I'm not sure if I'm allowed. But it's just been so nice. And Oh, here, let's see. There's the, the moon through my window, my dirty window. I need to clean it. It's just been a really, really nice camping trip. And uh, Betty... Betty has been so good. She's barked a few times, but you know what? That's what dogs do, and she just loves sitting out here with me. I love this dog. I had thought about giving her away, but you know what? I think that that would not be a good idea. I gotta do whatever I gotta do to make sure that she's comfortable and happy being my traveling companion. Because this girl, I tell you what, I don't, I don't know what I would do if I didn't have her. She is just the sweetest thing ever. So, yeah, there's my trash. I need to get rid of that. I gotta remember not to, not to let that, you know, stay there. But it's nice. This is just a very small portion of the back lake that I'm showing you right now, just before sundown. It's really pretty. Oh, come on, focus. 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 It is so quiet. You know what? The fish are still jumping. I had a very, very nice big fish dinner tonight for, well, two bluegill, two sunfish, and, um, oh my god, there is like a big something or other flying up there. I don't know if you can see it. No, it is not flying. It is actually a spider. Wow. A big freaking spider. You probably can't see it. But anyhow, I love this lifestyle. The only downside is when I have to go back to work. So when I retire, this is going to be me. Every single day. Every single night. I love it. I just love, love, love van life. Sure, there's some inconveniences, there's some downsides, but mostly it's been really, really good. Anyway, um, that's all I got for you guys. I'll talk to you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.